Hey there, everybody. Welcome back here. We got another taste test. This time we got M&M's, uh, the special kind of vote M&M's. We have the M&M's, uh, oh, Jesus. Those are kind of already coming out. The M&M's Crunchy Espresso, new Crunchy Espresso. And then we also have Crunchy Raspberry. Crunchy Raspberry. Um, I'm not really much of a M&M's guy because I just, like... You kind of just like put all, them all in your mouth and then you're done. I'm more of a kind of a candy bar man. And we can see right off the start, these are actually kind of un like not a uniform as compared to your standard um, standard m and So we're going to try the raspberry and then we're going to move on to the espresso. I do like the colors though. Let's see. We'll try this red one. But as you can see, it's um kind of the, one of those crunchy um, M&M's. Mm. Wow. These are actually really good. These are, like, really good. Um, I'm a big fan of... It's kind of bitter. That's kind of like what you're looking for in the um, raspberry. Raspberry tends to be a little bit more uh, bitter. But, yeah, this, these taste really good. I also suggest if you um, want to test out more raspberry-flavored drinks... Or foods, definitely check out Raspberry Coke. That's actually surprisingly good. These are actually really good. I'm actually really impressed. I thought there would just be like some shitty raspberry. Wow. Holy crap. Woo. A dark chocolate version of this would be pretty crazy. That would be really bitter. Dark chocolate tends to be more bitter. But yeah, um, I would definitely recommend these. These are really good, these um, raspberry M&Ms. Uh, definitely, definitely worth it. Check it out if you're an M&M fan. You can definitely taste the raspberry. Um, the crunch is really nice, too. But definitely a better kind of candy. Over here, we have the espresso ones. And... Um, these, I mean, I find it really weird that they're not kind of uniform except for some of these. They're all like different shapes. These actually, I wonder if they're trying to represent some sort of um, bean. Ooh, that, holy crap, that is mocha. Wait, these are not crunchy. This is just solid. Hmm, wow. They seem to be different. Oh, the crunchiness is actually um, black. That is not a, just a solid um, black um, black piece of candy like a typical M&M. There is some crunch to it. These are also really good. Holy crap. But again, just like the, um, the raspberries, they are kind of bitter. That's why, like, they say that adults tend to like more dark chocolate compared to, because, like, um, milk chocolate, milk chocolate tends to be more fattier, tends to be a little bit more sweeter, while dark chocolate tends to be better, and uh, better is developed a little bit later in life, and people prefer the better taste of um, something, while it, if you're younger, you're less likely to, to like it. It's it's actually very crazy that, uh, that as you get older, you're bitter, uh, you start to like bitter things. Like, I'm a big fan of lemon. But these are really good. Not really overpowering. Very, very mild. These are a very mild raspberry, but they, they have that nice raspberry bite that you get when you're in a raspberry. I'm a big fan of raspberries. I think they're a great berry. Very nice, bitter, but not too overwhelming. I'm a big fan of mocha, kind of espresso type of stuff. It's kind of the same thing. This seems, again, this is a little bit more stronger of a bitter. You could definitely taste this. You know what? I wonder what this would taste like in some coffee. I bet that would be good. As You know, some people actually dip like a little stick of um, a pretzel stick with coated in chocolate into their coffee. I wonder how that would do. Um, if they, not just M&M's is poured in, but like some sort of very similar thing. Um, but this is M&M's espresso and M&M's raspberry. 
if you see these, these are actually really good. I, I recommend both of these. Um, of course, they are bitter. So, anyways, guys, if you guys have any more suggestions on food or even drinks, say them in the comments. As always, thanks for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share it out to your friends and family. If you want to buy some PC games, make sure to check out the links down below. I'm a humble bundle partner. Anyways, guys, see you on the next one.